Hey here the Power of the Sunnies, welcome to another Minecraft video. Um, so, today I'm just gonna let you guys know, this is not an Epic World 5 video. I'm not quite ready yet, I still have to do part 21 of the castle. Um, I've done up to parts 15 through 20. So, you will see another Minecraft video soon after I am finished with 21. There is a lot of new stuff. Um, but today... I am just going to show you guys that I added a new texture pack. Um, I'm going to take this world, for example, Blazy, and I'm going to show you guys what this texture pack looks like. It looks absolutely fantastic. Unfortunately, I did a poll on it and only got six votes, but there were some people who did vote um, for some of these texture packs. I will be showcasing all three of these texture packs, though, but I'm going to be showing you the one that we will be using from now on. Um, uh, my packs. So I'm going to be showing you guys all three of these ones. We're going to start the one with the least amount, and then we're going to work up to the next two. So we're going to show you guys the candy one, the natural one, and the fantasy one. You guys will love the fantasy one. So the candy one's up first. So, yeah. I am I do like all three of these texture packs, although there are some that I would not play as much as more. I would play the Fantasy one way more. That is my absolute favorite texture pack, by the way. That's why I kind of gave this poll, because I wanted to see. Unfortunately, I only got six votes. I was hoping for more. But not very many people are interested in my Minecraft stuff. But still, I like to do it just because I like to have fun. So, yeah. Um, we will not be in creative. Um, we will be in survival for this, so for once I'm not in creative. And for once a video that's not on Epic World 5. Oh god. There's no color to the bar. Oh, here we go. Yeah, this is the candy one. Uh, if you like lots of candy... And foods, well, this texture pack is, um, this one is all yours to like. There is some good stuff and perks to this texture pack. This texture pack, I'm kind of surprised it didn't get more votes. Only one person picked it. But, I can see why it only got one vote, but I might do another poll and say which one's your favorite. Like, like I'll put candy, fantasy natural and updated original i'm not gonna put original i'm gonna put updated original um but yeah um this is cobblestone look look in here there's a bunch of food so you guys see the outside part yeah and dyes are in like actual paint bottles like an irl wait what was that oh that's a music disc Music discs are donuts. Look at all this freaking food. Glowstone's eggs. There's a lot to like about this texture pack. I, I know. I wish this texture pack did get more votes, but then again, a fantasy one is my all-time favorite. And yes, the the beds are made of chocolate. I, I do like this texture pack. It's very scrumptious. So if you guys love food and all that stuff, this texture pack is for you. I'm gonna show you guys the bottom room here first. I haven't really been on this world much. It's kind of a storage slash enchantment area. I haven't really played on this world since, as you saw, December 16th of last year. Which has been almost four months since I've last been on this world. So I've got a lot of progress that I need to finish up. And plus I will be doing possibly my final 24-hour race of my racing life. On racing video games ever. I'm going for 24-hour race number 10. Is a lot. And here's the outside. Yeah, even the moon. Well, the sun's not there, but the sun and the moon are both made of food. Everything here is food. Your wheat is freaking lollipops. Which is nice. This is dirt. It's cake, pretty much. And here's all the f animals. Sheep, cows, chickens, and pigs, and all that stuff. They look very happy. Um, trees are ice cream, pretty much, and, yeah, uh, th those, that purple stuff, 
That's obsidian. Uh, the orange stuff looks like freaking orange juice or or Fanta. Freaking love Fanta. Uh, Fanta soda. Which I should have. I hope to have some Fanta again sometime. But yeah, it kind of does. I don't know if I should go in the Nether because I'm probably gonna get killed. Because I'm only just kind of showing you guys what these fish packs look like. Oh god, those are the mobs over there. That's sugar cane. That's sand. The, the flowers everywhere. Yeah, this texture pack will make you hungry. This is stained glass. I'm not the biggest fan of it. But, yeah, here's... Those are ladders. So, uh, I hope you guys like the looks of this texture pack. It does look pretty nice. I will not be using it, sadly, because, well, the fantasy texture pack won it. So now we'll be going to the natural texture pack, which had second most. Which, that is a fantastic... Um... Uh, uh, texture pack, especially for my castle. That is the unfortunate part, though, is that I do prefer the castle in the natural texture pack than the fantasy one, because the natural one just makes it look so... so real. Okay, so here we go. The natural texture pack. And kind of been watching some March Madness. Just watched the game. I've been going back and forth with some games. My team has not played yet. They will be playing, pl pl playing, playing later this evening at about six fifteen. Wow, that is loud. But you guys are gonna see what basically a very realistic texture pack would look like in Minecraft. This texture pack is probably the best realistic looking one that I've come ever have came across of. Playing the game, seeing it up for download, and seeing people using realistic texture packs similar to this one. But as far as my gameplay on this texture pack, I really do like this one a lot. And I know the game does take a bit of time to load. I'm sorry for the loading screens. But... This natural texture pack is probably one of the best ones I have I've seen in a long time, comparing to the fantasy one. Now this game is not loading, which is problematic. If it comes to it, I will cut it. Oh, nope, there we go. It just took so it takes a while. Sorry about the the music doing that. It's just it's just been a part of the game. So yeah, and now it's loading. This one is very bright as well, but this one is probably one of the cooler looking texture packs. This one is one of the best ones I've seen in a long time. Look at how realistic everything looks. Oh my goodness. Just, just looking at everything. Everything is so smooth. Everything looks freaking fantastic. That the dogs look really nice. The beds look smooth. And we are gonna come out. Uh, this is what my house looks like. Look at how good the Nether portal is. Let me actually get a closer up. Oh my game like there. And that's wheat. And stone actually has pebbles in them, which is really cool. And the way to get up to the Nether portal is through this. Look at how smooth that is. It may look different on screen, but when you're actually not watching the video, oh my gosh, this portal looks freaking fresh. As heck, man. And I think that's stone brick, I think. But yeah, look at how amazing this portal looks. The weed looks really real. Looks sweet. Uh, animals, we'll just hop on into the pen, get the sheep, the p cows, the pigs, the chickens, now everything looks real, even the food does, beef, pork, mutton, cooked chicken, and bread, oops, I know you guys didn't see that quite well. Look at how realistic this food looks. It looks like real life food. 
but that's just me. The water absolutely looks stunning, even though it's not much different to regular water. It still looks fantastic. Um, sugar cane looks freaking real. This one I might go into the nether for, just to see. Um, oh yeah, I haven't shown the basement yet. Look at how nice this looks. The wood looks fantastic. The enchantment tables look freaking royal as heck. And, yeah, the interior of the books. Or the enchantment room, I forgot. Is there anything in this chest? Yeah, there is. Um, yeah, because I was able to find some, uh... Some of those, uh, treasure maps. And I've been able to find stuff on those. The furnaces and the smokers and the blast furnaces look freaking awesome. I just want to show you guys the nether in this texture pack because it, it it just looks fantastic. The, I, I'm not actually kind of surprised this one only had two votes out of my six votes of the poll. Hearts look realistic. Yeah, they look nice. Uh, yeah, we're going to the nether. You know, I'm sure people have their opinions on these texture packs. I'm sure pe Oh, God. Um, I'm sure people have different opinions on each texture pack. Oh, God. I can't see anything. Oh, yeah. I spawned right here. Uh, how did I get out of here? I don't remember, but this is what the nether looks like. Oh, man. I... You just gotta dig up. That's really all there is. But yeah, this is what the nether looks like. It's cool. I think there is a way out somewhere. Oh, yeah. Actually, above. Oh. Oh. Actually, up, up in the ceiling. That's an interesting place to be. That, my friends, is a bastion remnant. I don't think I've been to this one. I might have to take time and explore this. Wow. The fire looks nice. Uh, everything looks cool. Just don't fall in the lava. Because if I do, I'll lose everything. I did have to cheat once, and that was to fly back home because I got lost. But other than that, it's only just been that one time I've done everything else in survival. So that's what the nether looks like here in this texture pack. I didn't show the candy one because well, I didn't want to. Alright, so we must get back inside. And so we can feature the winning texture pack. If my game would not lag. It's time to go to the winning texture pack. My absolute favorite. The fantasy one. Oh, it looks so good. It just does. Okay. Resource packs. No. And the fantasy one. This one was in the original texture pack before. It didn't have one. So here comes the best looking texture pack. You guys will see this in Epic World 5 at some point next week. Because I'm going to be doing part 21 of the castle next week. But because of me doing the last 24 hours in GT4 for the third time. I will be busy on Monday and Tuesday. So there will be nothing coming there. But I will get my... My stuff done on Mario Kart Tour. I will make sure to still post though on Twitter. And I'll most likely VC with my girlfriend the whole time. Hopefully. But yeah. The winning texture pack, the fantasy one. Everything is gonna look epic once everything gets loaded in.
This texture pack is freaking fire, man. It is absolutely amazing. And you can see by the way the loading screen looks, it's gonna, it looks good. You don't even have to use the texture pack for it to look good. It looks freaking awesome. But this one seems to be taking as long as like the other one was. But the candy one really did not take long to load. I'm not sure why my stuff is having a difficult time loading here. There we go. Now we got it coming along. Generating worlds. Should be getting up there any moment. Again, I'm sorry about the loading speeds. I don't know why Minecraft runs super slow. There we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The, the winning texture pack. I will be using this texture pack uh, once, you know, my game doesn't freeze. I will be using, this will be the new Great Sunny's texture pack in Epic World 5 and maybe some future series is possibly soon. I don't know, but look at the beds. The, if you read the description of this texture pack when knights were heroes or something, this texture pack is going to be awesome. Just look at the way this house looks in this texture pack. Chiseled stone looks absolutely fantastic. The wheat... The wheat looks like it's from medieval times. Oh yeah, there's some crops that I haven't gotten to back there yet. The animals look outstanding. Now, I could say that some of the animals, like especially the sheep, do look similar to the one in the realistic one. This is because this texture pack and that, that one almost look alike. But just different format. You see the pick... The sword, the axe, and the shovel. The hoe looks like a scythe, by the way. Uh, if you guys play with this texture pack, you guys should know what it is. But, uh, this texture pack is my favorite all time. This beats out any texture pack that I have played on before on online battle mini games with other people. Other texture packs I've seen people use in modded survivals. And, like, adventure maps and all that. This texture pack is my absolute favorite. And I w I'm thankful that one of my friends gave me enough money to buy GT7. Which is a crappy game, by the way. I did forget to mention that in the video. video. But, uh, I bought three texture packs and that's where these three came from. Look at how royal the enchantment table looks. Oh, I picked up an egg. Lol. Um, I'll just go ahead and put that in my chest. Whichever chest it goes in. Yeah, this chest was for that cobblestone achievement one that I was I was able to do. Uh, but look at how these furnaces, these smokers, and these blast furnaces look. The clock looks the clock looks so fantastic as well. The paintings look really good in this texture pack. I'm going to. Uh oh. Well, game is auto saving. I wanted to show- oh my gosh, my armor is killed. But I wanted to show you guys the, the paintings in this texture pack. Doesn't look like we're going to be able to see that unless I craft one. I've had issues on this world when it comes to paintings. Yeah, that's the hoe right there. Um, I, I guess I'll make a real quick painting and then I'll most likely conclude it. But, yeah, this texture pack is amazing as you can see all the different items in here. Wow, I do not have a lot of wood. That is the one thing I'm lacking. I should go chop a tree. Let's let's go chop a tree. And we'll do that. That's going to bug a lot of people. I might post this video in my Twitter, uh, Twitter, so you guys can see and find the video for your guys' selves. Please do take as much time as you want. This texture pack is freaking fantastic. Uh, where's my wool? Now, if you guys do want me to switch to a different texture pack, I will do that, but it'll probably just only be for just the one video. Do I really not have any wool? Do I, do I really not have any wool at all? 
I'm not using that pink wool. Okay, I've got a black wool. Uh, that's a barrel. And I was able to do the, um, the achievement for the all the colors of wool. I was able to do that. That one I barely got through before I had to go into cheat mode. Let's see. It's not giving it to me. This world is broken on paintings. But you guys saw what the painting looked like. I'll probably just get a new one off camera. I mean, this isn't some my survival world, but I might make another one. Just for the fun of it. I'm, pre I'm also planning... Before I do conclude this video, I do have a couple of announcements to make. Um, I did lose two subscribers. Shame on you for that. Um, a Minecraft Xbox 360 is uh, Let's Play is in the making, as well as Mario Kart Wii and a bunch of like Mario Party games, like Super Mario Party, Mario Party Superstars. That is all in the making to come soon. I'm not sure when I'll make them, but they are coming soon. I'll probably be making. Oh Jesus! That actually scared me. If you saw the phone move, that was because I jumped. <laughs> But, thank god I didn't knock it over, because that's my fear. Uh, and since it's a thunderstorm, I can sleep. Haha! -ha. Take that, thunderstorm that scared me. Um, but, I, nothing happened. Oh wait, yeah, it did. Um, but yeah, there will be some more series coming soon. Not sure when, but hoping to get something, one of those, or a couple of them, started this Later on in the year, maybe towards the end of the year, maybe in the winter, maybe late fall, maybe somewhere around there. But yeah, that's kind of all there is. This is your winning texture pack. This will be the texture pack we will now use forever on this channel. And yes, I did change my YouTube picture, but I will still be the great Sinead's because, or Fear the Power of Sinead's because that will be my YouTube channel name forever. And it will stay like that forever. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to burn up the like button, just show the subscribe button, speed through that notification bell, leave a good comment down below, follow me on Twitter, The Great Sneeze, check out all my YouTube videos, my playlists, check out Blue Vivocity, and Sonic Central, their YouTube links in the description as always. And if you guys are new to this channel, be sure to have a thing, everything I just said, sorry about that, I was about to yawn. Um, it does help out a lot, and be sure to check out Blue Vivocity and Sonic Central, their YouTube links in the description as always. And I know I didn't go out in the nether, but the nether looks just as good in this texture pack as the realistic, as the natural one. They look really sweet and freaking awesome. But you guys will just have to find out for yourselves if you can find someone who plays in this texture pack and they go in the nether, you guys will have to check for yourself. So in the meantime, this will be the first video of the next Epic World video, which will be after I complete part 21. So with that... It's great to see you soon. Catch you guys soon.